Hey, I'm Henry. I'm the artist who painted the lodge in here, and uh, we're about ready to pop inside and take a look at it. Come on with me, guys. Here it is. Magic is everywhere. Inside and out. I didn't realize you did all the art up here. Yeah, man. Yeah. How long did that take you? Uh, pretty much the summer. Yeah, yeah. It's awesome. Yeah, about a month and a half. Maybe. They're cool, but like compared to um, what I'm painting, it's the you know, it's cool. It's like a historic, they're historic relics, and that's neat. But. Um, <laughs> Oh man, I uh, like well, grew up uh, around here. I grew up in Enumclaw, and I worked up here for three different seasons. I did a couple winters and a summer. I was a lift op for a summer, and then I worked as a, a, bus, a table busser um, for a couple seasons, and uh, got fired. I think each time I worked up here, um, and I was like. But yeah, I was on the no rehire list once and I still talked them into hiring me, but I just have always um, had a strong connection here. I had a couple of my really good friends I grew up with that lived up here. Um, uh, one of them's dad was the mountain manager and then um, another one, uh, uh, they owned a, 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 a ski uh, hotel down there. And, uh, so I would just come up here a lot anyway to hang out with my friends and then I was really into hiking and, um, and really into snowboarding growing up. So Crystal Mountain was, uh, has a history, I have a history with the place and I was um, uh, kind of making a decision what I wanted to do this summer and which direction I wanted my life to go and I had all these different options kind of coming at me. And, uh, I kind of tend to take an option and make it bigger than it presents itself. And so I have been selling my merchandise out of the gift shop here for a few years and uh, they hit me up and wanted a mural and, uh, um, and, and maybe a couple other little things, uh, just kind of a small project. And um, I, uh, I went for a hike before, the, um, before I met with them about that and I just was like, kind of envisioned something different, like what do I really want to do with my life? And I'm constantly asking that question as I go through my life, like um, what happens is I may make the decision, oh I want to do murals and be an artist, and then that can go so many directions, you know, there's like a myriad of like options you can take with that, and, like staying in like an empowered person. Kind of always have to like look at your options and choose what fits you best. And uh, I've just been really loving hiking and um, getting kind of back in. I've like, dedicated so much of my time and energy to only painting murals in the city and in cities that like I uh, am just thirsty and thirsty for like more hiking, and more nature, and more getting out in the outdoors. And so I've been doing that. And then, like this little thing popped up and I was like, I'm gonna make this a big thing because this is what I love. Like I love hiking, 
I love camping, I love nature, I love wildlife, I love being in uh, places like this. And, uh, so I was like, how can I be in this place longer? And so I, I pitched the idea of letting them um, uh, let me live up here for a year and, uh, and spend the summer. I'm basically going to spend the summer painting the spot and then, uh, then I can uh, keep my accommodations here for a year and get the season to pass and snowboard all winter, which I haven't done in a while. It's been many years since I've put a full season in. Uh, no, I'm not going to do that. I was just like, God, this is just what I'm going to do. So, and then I'm like, then it might, my hope is that it tumbles into more stuff like this. In the lodge, um, yeah, I I think this like uh, what corner would that be? The south southwest corner of the lodge, um, and it just I think the way the walls are laid out, it's gonna feel like when you walk in there, you're gonna feel like a you're surrounded 360 degrees by the work, and um, that's gonna. That's my favorite spot because of that, like, I can create this. I mean, the whole lodge is going to be cool because of creating this, like, environment that you're surrounded in. And that's kind of, like, my passion as a muralist right now is, like, creating environments that you're, you're in a world rather than, like, this thing's in my world. And I'm looking right at it, like, you're in, you're going to be in this lodge you're going to be in Henry land um, and I'm into that uh, bringing people into the, the mind um, but uh, there's this one space in particular that uh, you, you'll have a 360 degree surround experience and um, I'm excited to do that spot the most because of that yeah Are we done? I think so. Cool. That's how you paint a lodge. Okay. You sure wondered? This is how you do it. You just do it. You just paint the lodge. You just lodge your painting in the lodge, and that's it. Makes it sound so easy. Oh yeah. He's cool. Yeah, this is how you paint a lodge. You just get in there and you paint the son of a gun. Um, it's been an adventure painting this thing. Um, a lot of different stages. Uh, took me like four days just to tape it and put the design up. And then uh, had a crew of friends come in and help me paint the blue and the white and get the base, kind of the base down. And then um, just painting a lot of days in here by myself. And then I had, um, uh, my friend come in and help paint um, for a couple days and, uh, and then a few more days by myself and uh, it's been a lot of hours on this thing but you can feel it you can feel the time um, and I think it's maybe the coolest thing I've ever done and it's really like kind of embodies my passion which is creating environments for people to come into and get a full experience within an environment and be surrounded by the work um, and that's kind of what I'm like uh, really really interested in doing and have been for a few years and when I get a chance to create a full environment 
um, and I've done it with flat stick pub a handful of times now and it's just uh, very fulfilling and I, I want to um, uh, do uh, more of this in my life where you um, it's not just a wall mural it's a full um, uh, it's a full room a full ski lodge um, uh, where you're surrounded 360 degrees I think it really like really opens uh, opens your mind up to the experience of it and lets you live in the land of um, these creatures in this environment and uh, uh, I think what that does is opens people's imaginations when they're in that environment they um, can't help but to be inspired to open their imagination when they when they leave they bring that like their own creative spirit and their own imagination out into the world and uh, yeah that's really what I'm interested in is uh, inspiring that in people and um, I don't know I uh, I just want to make the world a better place you know and I think that's uh, and somehow create a better world and I think by creating these environments it at least inspires imagination and in, um, uh, in some people that know how to make the world a better place maybe can um, do so a little better because they're um, a little bit more inspired to do so. Hey! Hey! Oh my god! <laughs> you did such a good job oh, this time, man! Hey, That's man. so awesome! Oh jeez! Every person that came in here for our weddings was very mind-blowing. Very mind-blowing. I love them. I started there and then I did it. I kind of went around <laughs> What do you guys think this is like how the lodge looked last year to how it looks now? I think it looks a little better. Like it's more cheerful. I don't remember how the lodge looked last year. It was a, it was a black hole of memory. No, I wasn't here last year. Oh, no, well, that, that explains it then. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What are your guys' favorite parts of all the paintings? I like the, like, you know what a big Yeah? The little Sasquatch guy? Yeah. Parker, what's your favorite? The small Sasquatch? Or the, or the horned god? I call him Bob. Bob? Okay. <laughs> Hell yeah! Whoa! Sweet! Thank you! Yeah. We're filming the end of the documentary for the um, lodge right now. Oh, you're doing a documentary? Yeah. So the lodge has always been great because you get your beer, you can get your hamburgers, and it's really a great place. But now when you walk in, you see a big sign that says, Magic is everywhere. And the magic really is everywhere. It's great to see it. Um, it's a really great capstone for your day of skiing, so Henry's always awesome.